Oh, Frederick. Hi. Hi. Listen, I'm so excited for you tonight, this date. All right. Gay men are not usually the best matchmakers for straight women. They have different goals. I have a good feeling about you, too. OK, I'm glad. But Frederick has great taste. So when he said he had a guy that he wanted to set me up with, why not? If I knew somebody, you would yes. go on a date. Yes. The guy's probably packing. I think it'd be great if I came flying down the stairs, yeah, which I always did. Cool. Hi, how oh, are yeah. you? He looks nice. He looks good looking, but not like too hot where he looks like he's like shiny. Thank nice you. to meet you. It's nice to meet you as well. He looks like a nice looking guy. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Cocktail list is here. There's this drink called the Skinny Girl Margarita. I've that heard of really it. I really want to try. Yeah. So can you make one spicy? Yeah, sure. Both on the rocks? Absolutely. Yeah. Thank great. you. Um, and how do you know Frederick? We work together. Are you on the same team? We are not on the same team. I don't mean sexually. I meant... No, well, I mean, both. You're correct in both assumptions. If my date doesn't like to bang men, it's a plus. Bing! Sonny, where do you live? We, I live in the East Village. Been there for 17 years, and I think... In the I'm, East Village for 17 years? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I first arrived in New York, and then I was on a TV show. So what was the TV show? Uh, Guiding Light. You were on The Guiding Light? I was on The Guiding Light. What was your character? I was the bad guy. You've murdered people? I ran someone over with a car, and she died. So you've had a bad history with women? Uh, on the TV show, yes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But you've never been married, have you? I haven't. Well, maybe I don't that's have kids why. Mm. Happy wife, have you been happy married? life. I have. Okay. And you were not happy wife? Yes, I was not a happy wife. Because of what I've been through, yeah, I would say dating is, is challenging. I know they always say you're not supposed to talk about exes, but I don't think I'm talking about exes. I'm talking about an experience I've had a pretty little, yeah. and a little bit of a rough road. If you don't count Dennis, any new customers coming into the restaurant? There really haven't been that many. I don't really take new people into my life in that way unless I really trust them or think that I can. You know, yeah. that happens. Yeah. So it's not what it was when I was in my 20s. And you went out and you got buzzed. And your job was to meet somebody, make out with somebody. And you're both ready to fly off into the sunset. So this is sort of me entering into the interpersonal world, let's just say. Oh, welcome. So, so you land it here. It's way more difficult to be so footloose and fancy free and just go on the road. Right? It's gotta be pretty grim. Yeah. 